So now that you've seen Team Primite on a racetrack, I want to introduce you our facility. So welcome to Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Let's go inside. So this is our office. This is where we are schedule and prepare and organize everything um, from logistic to hire people, communicate with our driver, customers. This is where we're all the, all the parts that we need as well. We are surrounded by trophies earned by the team, but also Alex in the past. So this is when Alex used to drive for Audi Sport um, from 2006 to 2010. He was a factory driver for Audi and the DTM and uh, Le Mans series. So he was actually one of the first drivers to drive their TDI power unit. A few other trophies here. It was actually a, a window from um, the uh, Viet Supercar he's been uh, racing with. Scott McLaughlin. They won actually Bathurst 1000 together. Some special trophies as well here. Um, racing in Australia, they actually <laughs> provide with surfboard trophies, which is very original. Back over here, we'll have um, a few of uh, Alex uh, helmets that he, he still has, and some of them actually have been exchanged with other drivers. It's kind of like something that drivers do, they, they exchange their helmets. So we actually have Nico Rosberg right here, Marco Andretti. Um, the rest of him looks like it's, uh, it's Alex's. We have one of his very first helmets down there. That was uh, way back in the 1990s. This is actually pretty interesting. Uh, and this is the very first time I met Alex. So Alex and I actually worked together. It was in 2016 for the 24 Hours of Daytona. I was uh, actually fueling this car as he was driving it. We were the two French uh, people in the team, so we actually connected very naturally. And uh, yeah, a few years later, we actually put a business together and we're on our race team. Part of the things we also do at Team Primat is uh, simulators. So we actually build and custom build simulators for uh, some of our customers. And we do have a league also online where we all race together. But mainly we use them to generate data, uh, coach our drivers and have some experience before we actually jump in a real race car. Everything you see here is probably the highest grade you can find for simulators. The pedal set is what you will find in a race car. The steering wheel is hooked up to a direct drive, so the feedback is really good, very precise. And the seat position is really equal to what you would see on a Formula car right now. This one actually looks like a iron board more than anything, but it's actually a lot more comfortable than most people think. But yeah, let's take a look at it. So just like in a real car, um, everything that you see here, all the buttons are functional. So it's actually a great way to learn which button does what and when you have to use it. It's exactly the same as what you would have in your real car. And you can crash as much as you want, it will cost the same. All right, so this is it for the office. Let me show you the uh, workshop now where we have all the toys. So here's our workshop. This is where we uh, store and work on all the cars. We have about uh, seven to eight cars here at a time. Uh, I would say we kind of specialize a little bit on the GT4 cars lately uh, with the AMG GT4, which we have about three around here already. Uh, we have an RA GT4 and another Lotus GT4 back over there. Cars actually consume a lot of tires. So having our own tire station here is very important. We store a lot of tires, different compounds, different brands. Uh, we do like to actually uh, test different tires and different compounds on the racetrack with different customers. But yeah, we do everything in here from mounting, dismounting the tire, recycling, balancing. So I'm going to introduce you our lead mechanic here working on the uh, Audi RA GT4. It's actually doing some uh, maintenance work here. We're changing the spark plugs, the coils and oil change. We're also inspecting all the undercarriage, um, inspecting the exhaust as well. So we actually took the exhaust apart. Uh, we're gonna inspect it for cracks. Adrian's been working with us for a year now. It's accumulating experience on race cars. Uh, you can definitely tell he's got some de dexterity that race mechanics needs. Um, always looking after your work, always looking after the hardware and stuff you do. Every single piece of hardware that you tie on the car has to be marked. So you know if a hardware or bolt or screw gets loose, you can actually look at it and see if it got loose. You don't have to check it with a tool. Uh, so I just finished, you know, the exhaust and I did the coils and spark plugs, which are right here. Uh, so the worst out of each side. 
it's gonna be this so this is the driver's side bank okay and this is passenger side same thanks for doing very good and those are the worst ones yeah yeah wow well, that's really good for a car that has um about what twelve thousand kilometers now yeah really good on the factory co uh, coils and spark plugs it's good yeah it's the, the result of a well-maintained well-maintained engine Thanks Mutual for uh, sponsoring us, also sponsoring the whole team for the past two years now. So help, it's helping us to get the very good lubricants to uh, make our engine last for a long time. Same for transmission and brake fluid. They've been, they've been there since the beginning and it's been very helpful. So once all of our cars are ready, uh, we prepare all our equipment, all the spare parts, tools. Um, we align the cars, we, do, we check the setup of the car here. Some of the cars will also like do a test drive around the parking lot. And uh, when everything is ready to go, we actually load them in our trailers, which I'm going to introduce to you right now. So here is our main trailer. This is the one we actually use for most of our tests and uh, race weekends. So come on inside and I'll show you everything we've got here. All right, so here is the uh, lower deck. This is where we actually load our um, tire rack, timing stand, we also have a little card we call that a tailor done as to carry the like, tires and fuel around the racetrack. Um, we also have all the hardware and parts here for Mercedes specifically, Audi. This counter also here where we can put our uh, the driver's helmets, um, a coffee machine, a bit of snacks, some hospitality basically during the weekend. Um, toolboxes goes inside those cabinets. We have a compressor and nitrogen bottles in there for our race weekends. And just up here actually this is where we put the cars. And uh, right in front, we have what we call the lounge and the briefing room. So this is where drivers and engineers sit down to talk about race strategy. Um, we also coach our drivers here. We analyze everything from their braking procedure, the time they're on the throttle, how much stirring input they're putting on, and we compare everything to a pro driver. It's a tool that's very, very important to improve your driving ability um, and to go faster and safer as well. All right, thanks for joining us. This was the uh, tour of our workshop. Uh, like this video if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you at Thunder Hill.